I'm sure most of you have seen this as well. This has gone somewhat viral on a TL, which is quite funny when you think about who this is associated with. I'm sure most of you have seen this already. So this is courtesy of an account on Twitter called um, The Chosenberg. And they decided to get this picture, which is already, which is on the Fire Naked Reddit, by the way. So these guys obviously, you know, perusing the Reddit. That Reddit must be so popular, even outside of people like us in the Bapaverse. But some non-Bapaverse person, or maybe they are a bad person. I, I, you know, apologize to Chosenberg if you are part of the homeless cats contingent over there at Chang's. But regardless, this person grabbed this screenshot from the Fire and the Kids sub and put it on their very popular Twitter. And now look at the fucking views this post has been getting: seven point four million views, which features um, Brendan Shaw's wife. Um, I don't know what's that thing called? Um, engagement check-in with her friend. So I guess Joanne, uh, so I guess Benishol's wife, um, friend is this one, right? Benishol's wife's friend is this one, right? This woman here, who's kind of, oh my god, look, I got, I, I got engaged, was so happy, and then Brendan Shaw's wife decided to put her hand there as well, and obviously her diamond ring, which you know, I'm not sure if it's real or not, you know, when it comes to Brendan, is the same size. It's sorry, obviously like two, you know, five times the size of fucking this lady's one which you'd think it'd be a bit of an issue for women because you know how women are when it comes to their wedding and their big day and shit, right? Or just the announcement in general. You'd think most women would have an issue with this, wouldn't you? Most likely. Most women will fucking hate this sort of shit and think it's incredibly unbecoming, tacky or whatever it may be. Maybe that's the case. I'm not really too sure. But I would fucking hold your horses on being critical of this lady and saying that she's being tacky because unfortunately for all of us, this woman's always been kind of tacky anyway. That's probably why they suit each other so well, her and Brendan, because they're kind of the same person. Because you remember this picture? Do you guys remember this picture? Find the kids subreddit, which features Brendan Shaw's wife posting the, I guess, the soft announcement that they're going to have a baby girl. Look at what they posted as a way to kind of introduce this kid to the world before, obviously, pictures were out there of the kid itself. A pink Hermes bag, a pink, a purple or say lavender Balenciaga bag, and a pink Fendi jumper. Can you imagine the way this is how you introduce your kid? And another one that shows a Celine bag. So it's not Celine, Chanel bag here on the side. So when you see this particular picture of her basically, you know, um, check in or dunking on her friend's fucking engagement ring when it's her special day, you'd think you'd think this sort of stuff should make it no surprise that the same person that would do this would announce their baby to the world like this with a pink bullet like what what is this what does these labels these brands have to do with your fucking kid like it's absolutely insane the kind of levels of um importance people like this put on you know money and shit but again she's very she's being somewhat consistent with her brand so let's actually check the comments i want to see what what these regular schmegular people are talking about when it comes to brennan Shaw's wife in that very you know unpleasant or unnecessary or unfortunate picture let's see what the comments say one comment the bigger ring appears to have a pa uh, a paved set diamonds which is diamond equivalent of a push-up bra versus her friend's classic free color solitaire oh really Okay, people that know about rings are saying that Benishol's wife's ring looks big, looks fancy, but actually isn't that big or fancy because, you know, her house is resting on certain bits and obviously the friend's ring is way better, which is fucking hilarious to be fair. So, love to see that one. Um, another person says, this will destroy some of my friend's groups I'm in. Another one says, I did not... Um, I didn't get that this was real. It just looks like two friends celebrating both being engaged. It's a beautiful thing. Yeah, it's true. Maybe, maybe, maybe they are looking too much into it, or we are looking too much into it. It's just like an innocent thing. It's not a big deal. Who knows? Another one says they won't let you. They won't tell you this woman would rather have a will of cheese than a ring. <laughs> the smaller one is classier and prettier, in my opinion. Opinion. LMAO. Another one says imagine trying to show your friend. Um, when your ring is ugly as fuck to show up your friend I'm assuming another one says is that what she's doing or is that what you're seeing fair if they were friends before this post that that ends immediately after it's nothing more than an ego stroking flex about who is bigger ring welcome to the club buddy backhanded compliment meant to belittle I didn't even, I didn't even clock that to be fair welcome to the club buddy could be a backhanded compliment I didn't even click that 
I'll clock that, sorry. Now it says big fake flashy perfect personality fit. Wearing a giant ring is a low status symbol anyway. So yeah, big up Ben Shaw's wife. Um they both go viral on the timeline, different weeks, different story. Hers is probably way more avoidable than Brendan's, you know. Just, you know, make it take it easy on yourself. But hey, what do I know when it comes to this stuff? What do I bloody know? Absolutely nada. Nothing. I don't know anything. I don't know anything. 